Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from InMotion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Today I'm going to show you how to use the shortcuts in cPanel. Alright, start by logging into your cPanel. Once you've logged in, you'll see under the Preferences section there's a Shortcuts button here. Go ahead and click this button. Okay, when you do that, you'll notice there's two links here. There's one to access cPanel, and there's also one to access your cPanel webmail. Okay, you can click these, and you can drag them up to your toolbar. I'm using Google Chrome, so your interface may look a little different. And you'll see it creates the bookmark there for me. And then I'm going to do the same thing with the webmail link. There you go. And now when I click these, it will redirect me to the login page for webmail or for cPanel. And you'll see I'm just getting that message because I'm actually still logged in. Uh, let me go ahead and log out and I can show you one more time. Okay, once I've logged out, now when I click access cPanel, you'll see it brings me to the cPanel login page. And if I click the access cPanel webmail, it will bring me to the login page to let me log in here as well. Okay, I'm going to go back to the cPanel page now and log back in. And then going back to the shortcuts button here, I'm going to show you how to create desktop icons. It's very similar to creating a bookmark by dragging them to the top. In this case though, I'm going to actually drag it to my desktop. So as I click this, drag it, drop it there, and you'll see it creates a link there. And in my case, it's showing as a Chrome image or icon, and that's because Chrome is my default browser. So yours may differ based on your actual browser preferences, but I'm going to do the same thing with this Access cPanel Webmail link. And now I have buttons on my desktop that will take me directly to my cPanel or direct me to my, web, to my Webmail. Keep in mind, you will still have to log in once you get to the login page. Uh, let me go ahead and log out, and then I can show you how it'll actually work. So let's try the Access uh, cPanel Webmail link first, and you'll see it opens up. I'm getting that message just because I've been switching between logins and whatnot, but um, I'm going to try the cPanel one as well, and you'll see that one also works as well. Now I can easily get to my cPanel and also my webmail uh, from these quick shortcuts or bookmarks. And I can also send these to people to allow them to have a shortcut to go to these places as well. Thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Did you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.